Hello and welcome back to the channel. Hey, I'm Ron with Ideal. In this industry tip, I'll give it to you here on category wire, like Cat 5e or Cat 6 wire. Now, I don't care what category rating the wire is, you ought to be aware of what the flame rating of the cabling actually is or what its fire rating is. And uh, you look at the National Electric Code, the National Electric Code has four versions of this type of cable for different applications. And one is what we call CMX, or communications grade wire for a limited purpose. And every two foot long cable, it should be marked CMX. Now that's typically used for outdoor ready cable that's above ground. The cable has a special uh, UV inhibitor in it so the jacketing doesn't break down in the sunlight. And in many cases, it's dual ready. It can be ran inside the walls as well inside the buildings. Now the next designation up from that is CMG or general purpose wire. A lot of your patch cords and things like that are CMG. Now, general purpose cable uh, can be ran horizontally or vertically through a building, but only up to two floors. And the reason is because when it catches on fire, typically stays on fire, and it puts off a lot of dense, toxic smoke you can't see through. So really not what we want in walls. As a general rule, we're going to ask you to put what we call riser-ready cable on a wall, in, in the walls, and it should be plainly stated on the box. And again, every two foot along the cable, it'll say CMR on it. And we can go vertically or horizontally through a building with riser-ready cable, multiple floors if we need to. Now, the, and the, the amount of smoke it puts out, if you take the heat source away from it, uh, the uh, flame should go out within a predetermined distance, pretty short. And the amount of smoke it puts out is not nearly as dense and toxic. Now, the highest rating you can buy out there in cabling is what we call plenum rated wire, or CMP, every two foot along the wall uh, wire, it'll say that. And uh, that's wire that can be ran through a building's heating and air conditioning uh, system itself, or what we call through air plenums. And, you know, uh, uh, a lot of commercial work is riser, but you'll also find quite a bit of it is plenum rated as well. And, it's, and when you take the heat source away from plenum rated wire, the flame goes out even quicker, and it puts off less smoke, and it's really what they want burning in a wall or in a fire, okay? So be looking for those designations on your cabling and be aware of the fact that plenum rated wire is about three times the cost as riser stuff, so make sure you're bidding the right things. And that's one of those things the inspectors are definitely going to know when they're on the job sites. So there's a good tip for you, folks, and I hope that one helped you out as well. Hey, I'm Ron with Ideal, and I'll see you on the next one.